Once again, everything uh, proceeding normally uh, with the descent of the Soyuz and its three crew members on board in the uh, descent module. Everything has gone uh, by the book uh, throughout the course of the day, just after 2 a.m. Central Time. Uh, the uh, crew members uh, said uh, farewell uh, to the uh, remaining crew members on board the station, the Expedition 44 crew of uh, Padalka, Kelly, and Kornienko. Hatches uh, were closed. At that point, uh, the undocking of the Soyuz from the Rosviet module occurred on time at 5.20 a.m. Central Time, followed by the deorbit burn at 7.51 a.m. Central Time to begin the journey home for the three crew members. And uh, you can see uh, that they're nearing their landing site now, touchdown just over a minute from now. Helicopters uh, comprising the search and recovery forces are on station, ready to begin the recovery of the crew once uh, the Soyuz touches down. And uh, you can see one of those helicopters uh, flying uh, in the foreground uh, with the Soyuz behind it. Just a few clouds in the area. Conditions very good. Temperatures in the mid 80s. And there's uh, the landing site, touchdown seconds from now. And we have touchdown. You can see the reefing of the chute on the horizon. Touchdown at 8.44 a.m. Central Time, 7.44 off and Samantha Cristoforetti are back on Earth. And there you see uh, the Soyuz uh, commander, Anton Shkaplerov, uh, first out of the uh, spacecraft that uh, he uh, commanded uh, to his uh, bullseye touchdown on the steppe of Kazakhstan. The search and recovery forces uh, arrived on scene in their respective helicopters uh, literally within minutes of the touchdown that occurred at 8.44 a.m. Central Time, 7.44 p.m. at the landing site. Uh, we are now about an just about an hour before uh, sunset, a little bit over an hour before sunset. Kaplarov uh, completing his second flight into space with a big thumbs up as he has helped uh, down uh, the uh, slide uh, of that platform. Uh, he'll be placed uh, in a comfortable chair nearby. Shkaplarov uh, completing 364 days in space on his two flights.
Спасибо. Я травматолог. Вот что-то беспокоит. Нет, все. Так, нет. Давай, давай, давай. Спине боли нету, голова не кружится. Ну, так, чуть -чуть, чуть -чуть. Чуть -чуть. Тошни... Здесь будет Не тошнит? Нет. Воздуха хватает? Да. Я Это чуть попозже, обязательно будет. Вадим Степанович, интервью будет брать. А это шли, можно? Вот сбоку все данные. Его назад а, а тут уже стоит ради Once again, uh, the Soyuz uh, TMA-15M spacecraft, the descent module, uh, with the Expedition 43 crew on board, uh, touchdown right on time at 8.44 a.m. Central Time, 7.44 p.m. at the landing site under uh, cloudless skies, uh, very light winds, temperatures in the mid-80s. Landing upright, uh, the uh, slide platform uh, erected very quickly around the capsule uh, with the search and recovery forces uh, that include NASA and European Space Agency personnel on scene. Anton Shkaplerov, the Soyuz commander, already out of the spacecraft. Uh, now the crew, uh, the, re the other two crew members in the process of uh, preparing to leave the spacecraft as well. Попробуй Антону дать трубку, попробую. На Антон, Ланчаков там. Алло, поверни, так не поймаю. Сколько это? Алло. И замер, замер проводим. Алло, Юрий Антинович. А, еще нет? Еще нет. Плохо слышишь, накладываем, все сели, без проблем. Все живы, здоровы. Рады. Все, с командиром закончили. European Space Agency astronaut Samantha Christopheretti, who spent uh, more time on this uh, first mission of hers than any other female on a single mission in history, 199 days, helped. Uh, out of the uh, Soyuz vehicle and now being placed in uh, her chair next to Anton Shkaplerov.
Shkaplerov and Krista Ferretti out of the uh, Soyuz descent module, now waiting uh, for the extraction of Terry Verts. Once again, uh, the crew will have an opportunity uh, to spend a few minutes, and there uh, is Verts popping out of the hatch. He'll be helped down uh, the uh, slide platform uh, that's been erected above the uh, top hatch of the Soyuz to join his crewmates. The three uh, will spend a few minutes in those chairs under a setting sun before they're, they're helped into the inflatable medical tent nearby uh, to begin initial medical testing to uh, doff their Sokol launch and entry suits and then uh, board helicopters later on for a two-hour flight back to the staging city of Karaganda to the northeast of the landing site. Thumbs up and a smile from NASA astronaut Terry Verts, the Expedition 43 commander, having completed 212 days in space on his two flights. All three crew members out of the Soyuz vehicle just uh, 25 minutes after their touchdown. An on-target touchdown at 8.44 a.m. Central Time, 7.44 p.m. at the landing site in Kazakhstan. Bert's talking uh, to a member of the uh, Search and Recovery Forces, uh, gesturing uh, to uh, characterize uh, how the Soyuz landed. And as you saw, the descent module did land upright, uh, which uh, helped to facilitate the extraction of the crew.